Hey guys, I'm Jema with the Arkansas CW, and I'm here with two very talented women. Um, I'll just go ahead and let you introduce yourself. I'm Deep Meserve, and I'm the author of Good Sam, as well as the screenwriter, as well as the producer. And this is Tia Sarkar, who stars as Kate Bradley, the TV news reporter in Good Sam. Oh, I, you just did it for me. I don't I have to say anything else. <laughs> <laughs> so Good Sam is the name of their movie. And could you give us a little bit of insight of, the, of what the movie's about? Absolutely. Well, Tia plays Kate Bradley. She's a TV news reporter who's seen a lot of violence, tragedy, natural disasters. And when she's assigned to cover a story about an anonymous Good Samaritan who's leaving $100,000 cash on strangers' doorsteps, she's a little skeptical yeah, at first. Yeah, I can imagine why. <laughs> she thinks it's a marketing hope, some kind of a scam. But she goes to seek this anonymous Good Samaritan and find out the, the important and emotional reasons behind the mysterious cash gifts. Yeah, I mean, that was a very wonderful summary <laughs> from the person who wrote the story. Uh -huh. um, yeah, she starts out as a very cynical person who has, you know, reports on violent crimes and, you know, murders and robberies and car crashes and, and sort of um, has a very cynical viewpoint uh, of the world. And then, um, of course, you know, these, these mysterious uh, uh money drops continue to happen and so she's she's sort of like coming from her perspective she's like sure that there's some ulterior motive mm -hmm. and so her she's she is you know sort of like very adamant about finding out who it is and uh and and what his or her motive is and i think throughout the course of the movie she sort of finds um as she kind of peels back the layers of the mystery that perhaps not not everything hasn't not everyone has an ulterior motive and and there are people out there uh, doing good for good sake and I think it's great that y'all made a movie especially um, in today's day and age that's actually has a good meaning behind it a good person behind it so could you tell me where the inspiration came from well I wrote the book and I wanted to write a story about a mystery where instead of looking for like the kidnapper or the serial killer we were looking for someone doing so good so I wondered first of all like who would that story be told from and the character that Tia plays Kate Bradley really kind of came to mind somebody who's curious who wants to find out the truth but also has a certain amount of skepticism about it because she comes from what we all see on the mm -hmm. news right but I wanted to illuminate the possibility of doing good because I truly believe yeah. after this journey that there are far more people doing good than we know about. But it took me the journey of writing the book to actually come to that conclusion because I think I was on kind of Kate's journey. Um, I also, I feel like I kind of personally, uh, I understood Kate's character really well because I sort of have that sort of initial skepticism or cynicism um, and so it was nice to go on the journey with Kate of like you know sort of uncovering the mystery and um, well I don't want to give anything about the story uh -huh. away uh -huh. <laughs> but it was nice to go on the journey with my character because I sort of s where I, st I where Kate starts is kind of my you know like m where I initially come from when I'm like looking at some a situation like that yeah so it's sort of nice to go to go on that journey with her yeah I can understand that and I love to see an uplifting uh, story behind things rather than downing like what you've done so being here at the Bentonville Film Festival what does that mean for you guys well this is not th not your first time um, I am so excited to be here and I especially am excited to be here with a film that was written by a woman uh, executive produced by a woman, uh, directed by a woman, Kate Melville, and stars a woman. And um, there was just like, I mean, not, you know, we had a wonderful crew and cast, but there was just a lot of like amazing, talented, uh, brilliant women involved in this film. And I feel like this film festival celebrates women who are, who are uh, doing important work. And so it feels like a perfect fit for us. It definitely does, because as you pointed out, it's women behind the camera with director Kate, who I know wish she could yeah. be here with us, as well as women in front of the camera. And for me, working with Gina Davis and with the Gina Davis Institute for Gender and Media for all these many years, I've just really um, got excited about showing this film to this audience that's already looking for examples of 
of diversity and inclusion mm -hmm. in front of the camera as well as behind the camera, but also a story about really how women are. You know, women have interests beyond just finding a love interest. Yeah. <laughs> women are accomplished. I mean, when you see Tia play Kate Bradley as a TV <laughs> news reporter, you get it. Like, <laughs> she can be both, you know, hard-edged and also soft and she can have a relationship and she can also be mm -hmm. a successful news reporter she can be curious but not any of those negative things that are stereotypes of women who are in control of their lives so i thought if there's any place where that kind of a story would should have its world premiere it has to be here because people are looking for that here. yeah and I cannot wait to see y'all's film. I can feel your passion, and I know it's going to show through your film. So I cannot wait to do that. Do you guys have any social media that people could find more on your film? I don't know. There's Netflix, of course. There's also the people can follow me. That's where my readers are all, like, they're throwing viewing parties. Oh, and nice. it's going to be super, super fun. And that's just on Facebook. And I know you're really big on Twitter. Um, mine, my Twitter is at Tia Sirkar, my name, and then my Instagram is at Tia Bird, okay. T-I-Y-A-B-I-R-D, and yours is your name as well. Yeah, and my name is spelled D-E-T-E. A lot okay. of people are spelling it the other way, like diet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Deep Reserve, and uh, that's where a lot of readers and people who are excited about the movie are, have been sharing, you know, real acts of kindness that have come as a result of mm -hmm. this story, and there are lots of really tremendous, um, great stories about this in real life so we I feel like that real life is imitating fiction and fiction is imitating real life mm -hmm. and I had a great time speaking with you women and I think it's great what y'all are doing with this film um, so is there anything else you guys want to say no thank you for having us yeah and please watch good Sam on Netflix starting on May 16th May 16th <laughs> well I can't wait to see it guys thank, thank you. you thank, thank you. you so much thank, thank you thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.